Researchers gathered 160 uncaffeinated adults, people who consumed less than 500 mg of caffeine a week. These decaf subjects looked at pictures of various objects, then took either a placebo or a pill containing 200 mg of caffeine. That's roughly the amount you'd get from two cups of coffee. Surgeons in New York City successfully attached a pig kidney to a human patient and watched the pinkish organ function normally for 54 hours. Such procedures have been done in non-human primates. However, this is the first time that a pig kidney has been transplanted to a human body and not been immediately rejected.
Competence in mathematics was another trouble spot. More than half said their real task, school's graduates are deficient in mathematics. More than 10% of respondents and said college's graduates are deficient in the subject, while 70% said they are adequate. It's not that human activities didn't impact wildlife at all of course. Heavily hunted species, like white-tailed deer, gray squirrels, and raccoons, were photographed somewhat less often in hunted areas. Coyotes showed up more often in hunted areas. While most species didn't avoid hiking trails, the predators actually preferred them. Currently, integration is increasingly needed in the business environment. This need emerges from the efficiency and synergy requirements necessary in a complex and turbulent environment. In other words, integration is needed to facilitate coordination, which is again related to the building of competitive advantage.
One of the great contributing factors to mental illness is the idea that we should at all costs and at all times be well. We suffer far more than we should because of how long it can take many of us until we allow ourselves to fall properly and usefully ill. Countries bordering the Mediterranean have built up a solid reputation for sunshine, great tasting food as well as impressive health statistics, featuring some of the lowest rates of heart disease, and increased life expectancy. This has created a lot of attention towards the Mediterranean diet, which is not a typical weight loss diet, but more of a set of habits. Any writer must decide upon an order and a structure for a book in keeping with the reflexive nature of the work. There are strong currents of reiteration in the book, with each iteration developing understandings of research, theory, and practice as the story continues to unfold.
Most peasants remained self-sufficient and skeptical about money, and with good reason, the triumph of capitalism probably made them worse off. They now had to deal with a centralized imperial state that was collecting tax more efficiently, giving more power to landlords, and slowly reducing customary peasant rights to land and produce. Housing fulfills the basic needs that people have for security, privacy and shelter. While the adequacy of housing is an important component of individual well-being, housing also has great impact on the nation's economy, with its influence on investment levels, interest rates, building activity and employment. As we progress into the 21st century, communications are becoming faster and faster. Think of millions of different media images you are bombarded with every day. It is as important now to be able to read and make sense of those images, as it has been to be able to read ordinary text.
A microbe can either reproduce by dividing or it can conserve its energy and maintain only its most basic functions. One possibility is that in the unfavorable conditions under the South Pacific floor, the microbes could have been dividing very slowly over centuries. In this case, the microbes in the study may be the descendants of an even more distant past. Scholars build their own personal libraries to support not only particular projects but also general reading. In their field, they buy or make photocopies of materials when possible, so they can consult them frequently, mark pages and write annotation on them. When moving into a new field, they add to their collections, usually concentrating on primary texts. China's war on particulate air pollution is causing more severe ozone pollution. According to the new research, there was so much particulate matter in the smog around Chinese cities that it helped to quell ozone production by acting as a sponge that collected chemical radicals.
Organelles are the biggest difference between bacteria and cells that make up the human body organelles. You are a eukaryote. Your cells are eukaryotic. Eukaryotic cells contain membrane-bound organelles, including a nucleus. Eukaryotes can be single-celled or multi-celled, such as you, me, plants, fungi, and insects. A study of nearly 2,000 children found that those who reported playing video games for three hours per day or more performed better on cognitive skills tests involving impulse control and working memory, compared to children who had never played video games. In most animals, the brain is located in the head, protected by the skull and close to the primary sensory apparatus of vision, hearing, taste and olfaction. In humans, it is an organ of thought. While all vertebrates have a brain, invertebrates have either a centralized brain or collections of individual ganglia.
Ministers have rehearsed for the Queen's death for the first time with a secret exercise to prepare for ten days of national mourning, it has emerged. The run-through, apparently known as Castle Dove, saw cabinet ministers and Whitehall officials discuss, D plus one foot, the day after the monarch's death. Oh, yeah,